Okay, let's create a female character this time. Perfect. A buff redhead. Let's go. Send me to the mainland now. And I think we want to go to Varrock. Alright, there should be enough supplies for us to get into the next bracket from our main account. I guess we can do preservation. That should be fine. And let's also get the feral fighter, which is the most useful of the three. Sweet. Okay, those three sigils should be good. Next, let's bury all these dragon bones. Does it hold shift to bury? It is. Bury. There we go, 45 prey up. Next, we need to unlock the cannon as fast as we can. So I'm just going to quickly go down and get the quest done. Is it this way? Complete. Now we're going to have to go quickly buy the cannon ourselves. Okay, now we need to quickly buy ourselves a house. Sure. Fuck, I forgot the teleport to our house. Okay, so we need to build a few of these. One more chair. All right, done. We can now put our house in Relica. So far, the progress is decent. Not perfect. We made a few mistakes, but... I think I've only lost like three or four minutes at most. And I think I set up my cannon somewhere here. Let the super fast leveling begin. Forgot my fire runes, unfortunately. So we have to make a quick bank. But everything else, the thing is set up nicely. And all this will keep our HP nice and low. So then we can get the desired stats that we want to finish with. 36 combat. We need another, what's that? 14 combat levels in 14 minutes. I haven't started training defense yet. So I think we should be fine once I start training defense. And 55 range, almost 55 mage as well. So our progress is pretty freaking good. Immunity is up, which means we can no longer stay here. Oh, there's 51 combat. Head to the next bracket. All right, should be good. Bro, this guy would be so confused. He's just like, he's not even fighting the rock crabs. I feel like he's watching me and he's like, bro, I'm just so inefficient. I'm just going to sit in my corner and let this guy be a sweaty nerd. Like, I reckon my account is going to be finished by the time this guy gets like 60 attack. <laughs> oh, there is a breach. We're going to have to pause this real quick and go do that on our mains. Let's go, let's go, let's go. It is breach time. Hello, Ice Sparrow. Huge 55. So we like to see. Now I got stunned by the boss again. And he's decided to run. I don't think it's going to work, brother. We are, in fact, in the middle of nowhere. KO. Let's go. Go for it, brother. Oh, we had a few things. Very nice. All right, we have about 15 minutes left of protection. And so far, our stats are almost 70 magic, almost 70 ranged, 40, 52, and we've capped out our defense at 42. So I expect to spend roughly two hours or so um, unprotected. So I do need to find some cheeky little spots that I can train in. Okay, so yucks are significantly safer than rock crabs because we are no longer in multi. The safe zone is literally right here. So it's just like one freeze tank and I'm Good. Protection is pretty much over. We are 61 combat, 69 mage, 69 ranged, almost 70. And our melee stats are looking pretty good as well. 40, 57, 42 at 61 combat. And there it is. Our timer just ran out. Now the odds of us dying here is going to be very slim. However, it is still going to be quite annoying if we do die. So I'm going to go buy some stuff to make it easier for us to tank. All right, let's put it in for 1550 and hopefully buy soon. Hopefully. There we go. 71 combat. That was like bracket one into bracket three in, well, like three and a half hours, four hours, which is pretty freaking good. 65 attack complete. So now we just train strength all the way up because these two are now complete. The next milestone is technically 78 strength because that is when I can wear the Stadius Warhammer, which gives me roughly a 25% DPS increase over the D skim. I've got less than one minute of PVP protection left. And we are very close to 70 strength, very close to 80 ranged and 80 maged. I think these are pretty solid stats to get like 90% in the protection period. So I'm really, really happy with that. Time has run out. So let's pick this up and get the fuck out of here before we die. Okay, these are the main items I think that I need from my other account. I still have enough on this account to PK with, which is great. I just need to kill the other account for the emblems. That way we can get ourselves full void. GG, kid. Hopefully the banky isn't too annoying to trade back. Uh, melee, gonna need imbued scroll for the B-ring eye. We should be able to get our defenders pretty freaking quickly, not gonna lie. See, I was hitting like a bunch of times. It's because I have a sigil. Every time it hits, it gets a 20% chance of hitting a second time. 
but I'm hitting three times. It's 60% chance every time. Oh, we just hit 80 range. I'm just AFKing, editing my video at the moment. And it turns out this is a pretty good spot. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> there's no way this guy actually thinks that's gonna work. Alright, well, looks like I'm gonna have to pick another spot. Hey, 80 strength coming in. Breach time. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, 48 KO. Let's go. <laughs> Sit the fuck down. I may be dead here. Nope. Yeah, like, not a truck. Uh, I think it's over, buddy. Yeah, good fight, bro. Where in the world is he going? Is there like a safe zone down there or something? All right, let's see these keys. Not bad. Average. Below average. Very nice, actually. That's a lot of sharks and that's a lot of GP. And 90 strength. Let's go. Also 86 combat. Only a few more levels to go, actually. I don't really need an Alk anymore. I can just grind the strength at like 3 mil an hour. Because I just realized we can cannon and Alk at the same time. So these, so my ranged and my mage will go up at the same time once I've maxed my strength. You know what I mean? 98 strength. 90.725 is the highest that we can go. We can go one more HP level, but that is it. So let's go finish off with ranged and mage. So both of these are roughly 1 mil XP per hour, and that's roughly 10 hours. So yeah, we're going to be stuck here for 10 hours. I didn't like the fact that I was risking like 100 mil, so I bumped up the offer a little bit, and we finally have it. Let's fucking go. I still need to buy aggression though, so let's just put it in for... I guess this amount hopefully it buys yeah i think it's worth about this so hopefully that buys soon let's go the sigil of aggression is in our bank okay so these are the three sigils we are rocking sigil of the ninja feral fighter and aggression there is a reason behind the feral fighter uh, the main thing is we have the two best tier three sigils in the game now which is really really good and should just be one more there we go 50 construction we can now build the teleports. It's good that I've already done all this, so I can pretty much remember all the portals I need, which is kind of pog. I nearly forgot, we're also gonna need one of these, so we can put down our glory. There we go. Quickly getting Horror of the Deep completed. That way we can range train with the Dagonoths down here. Um, I'm hoping there's not a lot of PKs that have done this quest. I do want to just do this so I can get the fastest possible range XP per hour. Yeah, now that we've got all the expensive sigils, we can no longer like die and lose 100 mil. The only thing that we lose are our cannibals, which I mean, they're not so expensive, so it's fine. But it looks like we're getting roughly two and a half to three mil range XP per hour, which is going to be huge. It's a massive time saver. And 94 Magician. Let's go. We can now use Barrage. I'm probably just going to stay here all the way to 99s. Um, we can PK whenever there's a breach now on this account. Uh, I'm just going to go for this random person. I'm already under attack. Who the fuck's hitting me? And he's dead. Good fight. Let's go. Successful trip. And we're out. What the? Alright, well, we're gone. Back, ah, getting hit again. And we're gone. Right, that guy's probably just going to camp my cannon, so we're going to have to wait for it to decay, which kind of sucks. So we've come here to train our magic. We just hit 97, and we should be able to hit 99 in about an hour. Because this is 3 mil XP per hour, which is not bad at all. Let's go, 98 range. We're going to hit 99 mage before our 99 range. We actually go PK with 98 ranged instead of 99, and just get 99 a little bit later on. But um, yeah, because I don't think this is a max hit for any of the weapons. I ran out of Alx, so I'm having to throw my entangles at these to uh, <laughs> get ourselves the 99 magic. But there it is, 99 magic, and get ready for the breach. Hopefully I have enough time to do it on this account. If not, we'll do it on um, the other account panic, but we'll see.
And this guy's dead. Goodbye, buddy. Oh, I forgot a looting bag. Oh, wait, I don't even have a looting bag. Fuck. But nothing in here, except for the super combats, are worth anything. That's just stupid. And then... Yeah, th like this is a better key and it's 163k. And inside the looting bag, 1.4 mil. That's actually solid. This is a solid 1.4 mil. Everything in here is going to sell for a good amount. All right, so we are 90 combat. Let's have a look at our max hits. With the javelin, we can hit a 53. It's going to be a 54, maybe a 55 at 99 range. But the ones that matter are these ones, the melee. 68 spec. 55 bonk, and this is 4 tick as well because we have the ninja sigil, which is huge. DDS, 40-40 with DDS, let's go. And then with a corrupted void waker, we can hit a 61, which is 100% accuracy. So that's actually broken. Should we hit that? Let's do it. Bro, why is the floor all bugged? It's so weird. You're dead. <laughs> First PK down for Void Max. Fifty-seven. What? Holy moly! Okay, so my max hits are a lot higher than I expected them to be. <laughs> Holy shit, this account is powerful. Let's go, a 6 mil key. We've got the Corrupted Void Waker and a whole bunch of stuff that is not worth anywhere near 6 mil. And then some supplies. I'm hoping Jagex fix this. I mean, I don't know if they can, but yeah. What the fuck was he doing? <laughs> Inside the looting bag. Ooh, roughly a mil because of the ancient staff. And a 1 million GP key. Oh, that's really good. That's that's actually worth a lot of money, all those manta rays and all the Karam ones. Nope. Hey, buddy. It's over. Not yet. What the f- Oh, he's cheating. <laughs> There's no spec bar on that, you dumb cunt. Oh my. Caught 4k HD. Thank you. He's unfrozen here. Dead here. Oh yeah. Goodbye, brother. Ooh, we got some food and coins. Fifty-eight. Forty-five dead. Five buddy. What's in the looting bag before we go back out? Seven hundred k. Fifty-four bonk to the head. I actually need this trinket of vengeance. So good fight, brother. Oh, very nice key. Two mil key. A lot of supplies, which is really good. 
I think these are actually worth quite a lot of money, as well as a lot of blighted sacks. We actually are running out of those, so that's very good. We've got the Trinket of Vengeance, which is huge upgrade. We've also got the Void Waker, which is 1.5 mil. We've got 400k cash and the Staff, which is like a mil. So very, very good loot overall. Oh my, 45 bolt KO? What the? There we go. I think he's out here. Goodbye, brother. I apologize. How much is in the looting bag? Not bad. 1.2 mil from those two people. All right, what's in the chest? We got three mil key. That's a very good key. A lot of runes, a lot of cash, and tons of brews. This is probably like a five mil key, actually. This is one of the best keys we've gotten. And then I sold with 300k key. Like, everything here is worth something, so very nice. Bro, is this guy stupid? Look at his setup. He really fucked up, hey. He's not even eating. KO. KO. Come on, brother. First, let's have a look at the looting bag. We got, of course, the AGS. Let's fucking go. That's like a mill or so. We also got full mystic and some other stuff as well. I was hoping for something a little bit better, but we did get a lot of manta rays, which is awesome, and some cash. So, and we'll probably use these as well. So, not too bad. Our last ancient page just bought. That's actually huge. So, we have a look in our deposit box. We have all of the pages. And if we put this into the book, it means we can actually sell this. And anytime we die now, we save like three to four mil. Because this thing's like three, four mil every time we die. Let's take these pages out. Put them in this book over here. And this should complete the book. Let's go. No way. Oh, wait. Oh my god, I thought he got away. Oh, what? What do we get in the looting bag? 310k, we'll take that. A solid 240k. Everything here is usable. GF, buddy. Bro, these axes are broken, but they're so weird to use. They feel like unnatural. Oh my, 64. I wish someone messages me this right at that, <laughs> right on that tick. And a 600k key, a very nice 600k key. Everything here is sellable. In fact, this is probably like a mil. Biz Cachino, Biz Cachino, Scott uh, BLS. I don't have money. He, if he goes through the gate, he's out near the gate. I don't have cash. Oh shit. Can you maybe go get some real quick? He's got a BLS. Uh, oh, I'm gonna hit. Well, we got the VLS, let's go. Nice. I was gonna let him trade it over. <laughs> so I didn't really care about the rest. Yeah. But it went into his bag. Rip. Pretty solid key, very happy with that. We got some supplies, which is really good. And yeah, and look at the looting bag, 10 million GP. We got the VLS and some alcohols and some extra cash as well. A very, very successful trip. Anyways, guys, that is it for the video. Hope you all enjoyed it. It only took us one day to build this insane account. Um, I'll get 99 range on it probably now before I go to sleep real quickly. Today, we focus on using the Stadius Warhammer. Tomorrow, we're going to bring out the Dragon Dagger, the Debo, and some other weapons and some other sigils as well because there's so many possibilities with this kind of account build. Yeah, guys, that is it. If you liked the video, then make sure to like and subscribe and all that. We'll probably have a video out tomorrow or the day after. And that is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed the vid and I'll see you all next time.